While I was uh, leaving work for the day, um, this 2014 FJ Cruiser caught my eye and I immediately thought of you, wanted to shoot a quick little video uh, so you could take a look at this. Look, this is the, uh, out of the three FJ Cruisers that we recently taken in, this is the nicest. I've already looked underneath the undercarriage and I'll show you in a minute. Uh, this is just in impeccable shape. Has the TRD wheels on it. Tires are knee deep on tread. Hey, if you're still on the market, I'd love to see if you could come down and take a look at this FJ Cruiser. Enjoy the video and let me know what your thoughts are. All right, now forgive the sun glare. Uh, it's the evening time and the sun's just going down. Uh, so it is the white color, which is nice because you don't have a uh, different colored body with the white top. You actually just have it all one uh, color. So I just wanted to get close to the uh, front of this here and show you. Uh, look, this thing is like rock chip free, uh, which is very uncommon on squared nosed vehicles like the FJ Cruiser. Uh, really in phenomenal shape. When I say this is the best out of the three we recently have, this is truly the best. Looking at the grill, no rock chips in the grill. And then moving down to the front bumper. The FJs were just been an iconic vehicle for Toyota. You know, they uh, modeled it after the old FJ40s when it first came out. Uh, then they ran them from, I think, what was it, 2007? And then the 2014, which is this model year, is the last model year for it. But uh, uh, the funny thing is, is that uh, the demand for the FJ Cruisers haven't gone down, uh, even though that uh, Toyota has stopped producing them. They are a phenomenal off-road vehicle. And then uh, these, uh, this one in particular has the rock rails on it. And so these, uh, these rails here, they kind of look like almost a tube step, but this is designed to protect the underbody and also the side of uh, the FJ Cruiser when you are off-roading, going up over uh, rocks, uh, going up over logs. Uh, you could literally uh, put those rails right on a, a, a rock or a boulder and uh, get around it pretty easy or get over it. Now I noticed there's uh, on the rear passenger side the bumper, there's a little scratch there and uh, right down below. Being this is the 2014 model, uh, this one will come with the backup camera. Has your factory tow package on it. Now let's talk tires a little bit. These are the BF Goodrich all-terrain TA tires. They are knee deep on tread, as I mentioned before, uh, but there's no concern or worry about you having to buy the FJ Cruiser get into it and then immediately turn around and replace your tire six months later. I don't, I don't think we uh, replace these tires. They do look like they have a little wear on them, uh, but the last owner did and then they traded it in. And uh, these are great off-road all-terrain tires. Definitely will get the job done. All right, well, I'm just uh, kind of standing, hunching over the front of this uh, FJ Cruiser here. I'm gonna show you the undercarriage underneath the uh, engine compartment. Uh, I'll show you on both sides, driver and passenger sides, and then also the rear uh, differential area of the vehicle. I'm gonna do my best here. This is kind of a gravel lot, so it's kind of hard to bend down or kneel down on it, but uh, you'll get a good idea. So this is your...
Thank you.